Tellum Tribe Tarot. Daily readings for my tribe. Subscribe to my channel. Peace. I am Cherokee with Tellum Tribe Tarot coming to you with another general love reading. This one is going to be for my Geminis. So Geminis, I hope you're feeling good, feeling great. Turn on post notifications, share the video to share the wealth, drop a comment to say hello to a goddess because you know I love it when you say hello and subscribe to the channel. So Gemini, we're going to see what's going on with you in love today. You know, we love talking about love at Tellum Tribe Tarot, most importantly, Gemini love to see what you have going on. Hopefully nothing controversial and nothing stressful, but you know, whatever the cards pull is what we will discuss. So whatever I pull is what we will discuss. Again, take what resonates and leave behind what doesn't. If you want to book a personal reading, the link is in the description and let's get into your reading spirit. Please provide me with the guided messages for Gemini. Please provide me with the guided messages for Gemini. So I'm going to start with a couple Oracle cards to gauge where we're going with this one, Gemini. Let's see. So the message is voyage. You already have all the answers. So Gemini, you may be coming back to my channel or feel an energy of someone who may be serial watching um binge watching tarot videos looking for an answer about a love situation where you already have the answer so maybe the solution that your intuition has so clearly provided is not the solution that you want and you may be in denial i do sense an energy of denial okay let's pull oh well this one flipped over so we'll go with this one criticizing one another will only lead to further unhappiness love and accept each other as you are and your relationship will magically transform so someone may be in a relationship right now and is having a difficult time with their partner as far as what they're bringing to the table at this moment causing unnecessary grief pointing the finger at the other person feeling unheard unseen feeling as if that person does not hear what they're saying no matter how loudly you yell and you may be considering leaving the connection that's one energy that i'm picking up on gemini spirit is saying i'm hearing listen I, I, i've been hearing like the messages for gemini as of recently is just listen so this is your energy gemini i am terrified so you're afraid that the relationship has changed the whole dynamic of it and you may be losing your person i imagine you naked someone else may i'm not sure where that came from that was left field but um maybe a couple of you or a few of you may be in separation from your person and you're sexually charged you're afraid that they may be sexting someone else this could be a random message that was picked up from outside of the connection, which is why it feels so cold and outside. You feel like your person may have blocked you out. I am absolutely in love with you. I feel like this is the message that you're trying to send telekinetically to your person. On the bottom of the deck is sex. So this may be a toxic connection, Gemini, where you are tied to this person through sex you may have had sex on the first night that you met this person but they turned out to be a godsend to your life in other ways but they may have just seen the connection as just a sexual connection and you're afraid that they may be doing you exactly how you may have thought which is being dishonest and 
um, you just feel like they're not telling you everything. And I feel like that's where the criticizing comes into play. So we're going to get some more information on this Gemini to see how you can get the answers that you're looking for. Although I feel like the answers are right in front of you. A lot of times we may give our power away by allowing other people to make the decisions that we have to make for ourselves for us because the responsibility of walking away or stating a difficult truth is too great so you may be looking for another way to walk away or you may be keeping your distance so that this person can do the deed or you may be afraid that you just don't have control anymore i feel an energy of being all over the place spirit please provide me with the guided messages for the gemini energy that i picked up in this reading who may be contemplating about their partner and not really sure where the relationship stands something happened all right gemini let's see so the hermit so yeah you may be in separation from your person your person may have taken a break from you gemini um, or the universe is pushing you apart because you may spend too much time together having sex. Um, I feel like love bombs, the love bomb, I love you's came really quickly in this connection. It may feel as though you were madly in love with this person. They were your ideal person. They gave you everything that you wanted and more. And then I feel like the universe is separating you through trial and error through experience through natural selection it almost feels like you're just not sure why these things are happening and now you feel isolated and that's why you're here the star so we have two majors coming out back to back gemini that's indicative of something that needed to change within you so that you can wake up from this dream that you may be living so i feel like someone may be in a fantasy world creating uh an environment that doesn't really exist in an effort to keep the peace or in an effort to simulate a relationship that you don't actually have so i do feel a bit of um delusion or illusion death we have three majors coming out back to back gemini and um death comes in threes and i'm not talking about an actual physical death i'm talking about the emotional depth that you have for this connection may have to change um I feel like what's happening in this relationship that you're not understanding is that you wanted something deep and something so deep and impactful really quickly. And I feel like you, you've You've tried to flow with what was happening in an effort to maybe sway it in your direction and it's not happening that way. The universe is showing you that this may not be the right connection for you. I feel like a situationship. I feel a sense of situationship like there's, there's been this situation. I don't know how long it has been, but the universe is saying that this is beyond your control. You can't control what's happening. It's out of your hands. Ooh, I'm going to take the one that's on top that flew out. <laughs> the Wheel of Fortune. Look at all of these majors on the board, Gemini. And on the bottom of the deck is the Knight of Wands. So I feel like you're dealing with, you may be dealing with someone who showed you a lot really, really quickly. And... In the same sense, it gave you a sense of security and a false hope. 
And I feel like you put all of your eggs in one basket. And when this person may have dropped the ball, you started criticizing them and blaming them and saying it's their fault that you all are in this predicament. But I wouldn't be surprised if the judgment came out. But I feel like spirit is saying that you gave your power away. You put too much trust in a human being. This person was very charming. They did a lot really soon. They probably said, I love you really quickly. Capricorn energy is present. Scorpio. Pisces Cancer is here as well. And now that the relationship is here, it's like it was never really a relationship. It's ending and you are trying to salvage it. Spirit, can you please provide me with some more insight on this? The Ace of Swords. So there was a conversation that needed to happen between you and this person for better understanding. And this person may not be the best communicator. They're more of, they just like physical, physical touch. They like physical exchanges. So this is more of a sexual relationship. But what your guides are saying with the sun card, even after everything is happening, all of these major changes, this relationship has really impacted your life in a major way. I feel like this person had a lot of power in your life, Gemini, and it's because you gave it to them. Power of attorney I'm hearing as well. I don't know what that has to do with anyone, but when you give your power to someone so they can either use it to help you or they can use it to manipulate you and with the sun card be being this beautiful energy coming into the light i feel like your guides are saying that the way out is by taking your power back and realizing that you don't need another individual to validate what you have going on in your life I also sense that this person wanted to control you with the King of Wands. They wanted to they wanted to control either it's a business or they wanted to control the narrative of the connection based on how they typically do things. And because you pulled back or you you uh, do, do what Gemini's do whenever you feel as if you're independence is being threatened or your happiness or your peace you realize that this person was too controlling and they only had their own best interest at heart and they also came with baggage they saw you as being the queen of wands in their life. Or they saw you as someone who takes handles business and handles things with authority. And they wanted to humble you. It's almost like this person was sent to destroy you, Gemini. But when they realize that you can see right through it, through the thick of what's happening, they, they bowed out. And that's probably why you can't hear from them. And that's why you're kind of confused. Like, what's happening? Did they, And I feel like for some of you, you're wondering, if did they steal from me? Why do I feel like they took something from you, Gemini? I feel like they're just milking your happiness. One second. I feel like they're just milking your happiness your joy and your guys want you to have the power to see what's actually happening and to take a stand for yourself the emperor definitely someone who is power hungry someone who thought that they can control you gemini and because they couldn't that's why they ghosted you gemini that's what it is they realize that they can control you the way that they control everyone else. And I feel like they went back to someone that they could control. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, energy present. That's where they are, Gemini. I know that's what you wanted to know. You wanted to know what happened. 
with the connection and that's why you thought it was because you were criticizing them and you may have judged them too harshly and you may have pushed them too hard but they were pulling back because they couldn't control you and they were draining your light and the, your spirit guides are saying that this is not your wish fulfillment even though that's what you thought it was Spirit, what is the closing message for Gemini? Well, all these majors here, the fool. <laughs> Gemini, you have to start from scratch. You have to let this go. You have to trust, like the universe is saying that you don't need an individual to validate who you are. You don't need someone to take you to the next sector of where you're trying to go in your life. Yes, people need people, but you don't have to sacrifice who you are to get where you're going. If that's what the sacrifice is, then we're, it's not worth it. The journey is not worth it. And your guides are saying that you have to be willing to start over, start afresh, start anew. Use this as... Um, Use this as a pinnacle of hope with the star card. Use this experience to educate you on the fact that everyone will not always be who they say they are. And you have to be willing to release any type of correspondence with a person. Even if you don't get closure from them, you have to give yourself closure in order to have your new beginning because you have amazing things waiting for you. There's hope for you with what what's in store for you, but you can't bring along people who are trying to mooch off of what you have to offer. I feel like you may have come into an abundance of something new, something that may have attracted people who doesn't mean you very well. And this person was one of those people and your guides are saying you have to get in the energy of letting go. All right, and I hope this resonated with someone. That's all I have for you, Gemini. If you'd like to book a personal reading, the link is in the description box. And until next time, love and light, tribe.